Ili kuwa mtu kwanza kupata taarifa zetu, usisahau kubonyeza button nyekundu chini ya video yako iliyoandikwa subscribe. Tuambie mwana kama una fresh. Mhm. Ibara kwenye teeth uh, teen talks uh, hapa uh, White Sand uh, Idris Sultan amefika kwa ajili ya kumsupport Abi Chams. By the way, ukaribu wako na Abi Chams. Umeuliza nini? Ukaribu wewe sana Abi Chams. mdogo wangu. Eh, yeah, so mdogo wangu I, I support uh, talent na siku zote unajua talent zikisupportiwa zikiwa changa sana ndio zinakumbukwa sana. Sasa hivi mambo ya baadaye watu ndio wameshatoboa vibaya sana afu. Na kwa maana kumbuka kipindi kile ulitoa sawa si nini afu kipindi wewe ndio unahitaji msaada. <laughs> kwa hiyo yani bora tu tupeane support ile mapema kama hivi alafu pia ni vijana wote tunapeana support katika level ya kuonyeshana kwamba kama makosa yangu nifanya mimi una haja kupita kwenye njezo hizo unaweza kufanya hivi. Kwa hiyo tunasaidiana kwenda mbele kuliko kila anayekuja anaanza upya yani ili umuonyeshe kwamba wewe inabidi uone ugumu wa game. Hamna haja kufanya mambo kama hayo. Kwa hiyo ndio maana niko hapa. Yes. Nataka kufahamu kwamba uh, najua unakutana na vitu vingi sana, pengine unakutana na vijana wengi sana. Mm. Sababu ya kukufanya uje hapa ni kwa sababu pengine ya idea ya Bichams ama na huyu ulishapataga labda watu ambao wamekudia, ama wamekutana nao vijana hasa hasa teenagers wanakuambia matatizo fulani, mambo mbona mm. hii ndio itakuwa platform labda kushia nao. I mean I mean I mean tarifu kuhusu jambo lake. Uh, labda tuseme kwamba kwake nilifikika unajua kuna wengine labda sikuweza kufikika uh, labda kwake nilifikika kirahisi zaidi na nikaona jambo lake lina, lina positivity na limeangukia katika siku ambayo sitakuwa na jambo zito ambayo nalifanya uh, ningekuwa labda mchezaji wa simba leo labda ndio nisingekuepo hapa lakini uh, kwa siku kama hii nadhani ni nzuri pia kuweza kusaidia vijana wengi sana ambao huwezi kujua hao ndo fans wetu wa baadaye yes, na wengine ambao ni wadogo sana hapa kwa kama uweze kuta hata mimi mwenyewe nimekuja kulinda maslahi yangu <laughs> ya ya kihela na nini na kazi zangu kuweza kununuliwa na vijana wengi zaidi mm. uh, so it's all about support na kwamba nifikia na jambo lake na nikaliona liko positive nikafika okay hapo yes. tuzungumzie kwenye kazi umesema pengine ndio watu ambao watakuwa na kusupport na kukusaidia kwenye kumanunuzia kazi zako pia na nini ongea mm. kwanza by the way kwa kuwa miongoni mwa watu ambao wamepata shave netflix no, asante 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 play nini mm. vitu kama hivyo ilikuwaaje watu wameongea maneno mengi sana mm. kuhusiana na ile issue kuwa muhimu muhimu yeah. wasipoongea ndio inakuwa tatizo kabisa yeah. hebu wape neno basi mm. dogo leo mshikaji wangu a kazi inaendelea mm. eh mwanza amesema kazi endelee kazi inaendelea kwa ni mule mule baya zuri wote tunasonga mbele cha muhimu ni kwamba yani kwamba hamna aliyekufa kila mmoja yuko hai na kwamba kuna matatizo yametokea na kama hamna matatizo yametokea basi tunasonga mbele okay. tunarekebisha pale palipovurugika basi tunaendelea mbele kama tulivyokuwa tumepanga kawaida tatizo lipi na ulivyo sasa kuna matatizo mengi mpaka kuna muda alisema ipo kuna muda haipo iliondolewa ndio kwa sasa haipo kuna masuala ya copyright ya, ya music na kuna kuna claims ambazo zimefanyika na Netflix ni kampuni kubwa sana. Mm. Haiwezi kachukulia uh, claims hata hizi za msanii hata uwe ni mdogo kiasi gani mm. au uh, kaclaim uh, sana na nini mziki wako umetumika labda bila copyright na vitu kama hivyo na ni baadhi ya vitu ambavyo havikutiliwa labda maanani mm. na ndio vinavyofanywa marekebisho. Na swala so, zima la kuishusha kwa jaya kuweza kufanya marekebisho lakini baadaye inshallah inapanda uh, ni jambo zuri sana kuweza kuonyesha kwamba wasanii kazi zetu zinalindwa mm. hata ungekuwa wewe mwanangu hapo umekuja kuimba mambo yako afu kidogo tu kuna mwana huko ametoka na jambo lako unajua kabisa unasema ambayo unaweza haki yako kaweza kuipata so kwa mimi as much as inaweza kawa ni jambo baya kuishusha mm. lakini nanipa nia nzuri kabisa kwamba jambo zuri linafanyika na sisi kama watu wengine katika level fulani unajua kila msanii ni mdogo katika level fulani yeah, sure. kwa katika level fulani bado tunalindwa na haki zetu nzuri unaweza ni kwa nini watu wengi hasa hasa upande wa tasnia ya bongo movie hawakukubaliana kabisa na swala lako wewe kuwepo pale mm. nani Unajua wewe taja yani. <laughs> kwa sababu ukiwa na manti kama hizo unataja ili mimi nikujibu kulingana na huyo mtu. Nani? Kama unitajibu mimi siwezi kujibu. Hebu nisali kumtaja. Anyway, tukifunika funika. Unafunika tena. Mwana haramu anaweza spite man. Kwa sababu mmoja kule anaitwa okay. Kuna hii issue ya 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 list of hopes pia ni mtu mm. ni mmoja kati ya watu ambao pia kwa na thati by the time na sio kwamba ni the richest au nini kuna list za aina nyingi sana na wale ambao ndo natakiwa walizungumzie ni wale ambao natengeneza hizo list mimi sio mzemaji wa malist ndugu yangu nitakuja hapa nitaongea kama nani rahisi 
unaziamini kwamba kuna watu wanafanya uchawi kwa ajili Uchawi upo mwanangu na ndio maana waganga wanaingiza hela. Haiwezi kuingia kama kama vitu vya vya nini. Una unahisi kwamba Forbes huwa wanakosea hata kumzao? Kila mmoja anakosea. Si binadamu. Kuna mtu anakosea mimi si yasemi. Ya watu wale wanapost pale moja. changes that were done to me. <laughs> I'll generalize here. Um, uh, there's um, the saying, I'm going to say, Fox Way, Miss Davis, Kofi Gereza, Dunia Tabara Bogus. Yes. Um, it is, it is, because it's, it's not the world itself, it's actually the people. Uh, we are the Tabara Bogus. And it's not the world in itself because we are the ones who are influencing the changes that are happening in the environment. So if I am to change my personality, it's, it's according to who I am interacting with. And that's because of how they can accept what I'm saying. If I am to tell you, stop. Some parents I understand nowadays have not taught their children to, to understand the word stop. They've only been taught to understand in a very um, modest manner, maybe you're not supposed to be told stop, you're supposed to be told don't continue. So on that factor, my personality has only changed to accommodate the different human personalities that have been approached by their different uh, upbringing from their parents. So I think I have been more social and more empathetic and more understanding of people's um, differences. So that has been my my general uh, understanding of how I've changed in terms of my personality. Yes. Hello everyone. Hello. Uh, personally, I think I, I wouldn't say much about that. There's a lot that has changed from when I was 13 until now. But it's obviously some for the positive and some for the negative, and that's what growth is about. You grow, so basically you change. It's, it's inevitable. Uh, I've changed in terms of speed. I think I'm much more, as you know, Abby was saying, when she couldn't make her own decisions when she was younger, but she can now. And I think that's one of the biggest things that's changed in my life. There was more I could do when I was younger, but I couldn't make decisions for myself. Now I can. So basically, if you ask me, nothing really has changed. I was hungry then, I am hungry now. 